Homelessness is a problem in many communities, but one local organization is hoping to lend their youth a helping hand. News 10's Lacey Clifton has more. Paris teen Austin Porter has faced many challenges in his first 19 years of life. I had to pick or choose who went electricity this month or water this month. Porter grew up in a home with several siblings, parents struggling with drug addiction and a lack of basic necessities. Wasn't going to school at all. I was pretty disrespectful back then. But a major turning point for Porter was him joining the safe school program called Bridges. First thing that it was help me get to a place where I'd have necessities so that I could focus on school and all that. After a while, with a lot of effort from them, they molded me into someone who's wanted to work hard. Porter and others in the program have also been helped by an organization called Hopes and Dreams. Both programs aim to help students take control of their lives. We have about 10 students who we've put into apartment settings. So in that situation, they have actually been able to pay their own rent while working and going to high school. So that's a lot of adult responsibilities in addition to just trying to be a kid. The Hopes and Dreams organization wants to create a hope house and safe teen hangout to help teens like Austin focus on school instead of basic needs. When you don't have a place to stay, you just feel unsafe. You feel unsecure. You feel like you don't mean anything. So we would like to be able to provide a place for students who are 15, 16, 17 and going to school to be able to stay without having to work full time. In Paris, Illinois, Lacey Clifton, News 10. Sounds like a great organization. The Hope House would be a 16 bed facility for teenagers and a place to shower and get homework help. To get involved with this project, visit our website, WTHITV.com. People who